Hello everybody, I'm just about ready to get started. Looks like we have a new follower, so let's give a special shout out to Tired Coffee, zero zero. You're wide open! I'm feeling the fatigue, I'm not gonna lie to you, chat. It has been a brutal week so far at work. But I figure we'll spend at least a couple hours exploring a little bit of the Valentine event. Hopefully there's some people online today. But for those that haven't seen or heard of the Valentine event before, essentially the game is going to reward you for grouping up with people. So hopefully we'll see some people here. So basically, by myself, I'm going to get a 0% bonus. If we get up to four people, we get 20%. If you match your uh, character's forecast bonus, so for example, if today I might be droid male, I think. If people play droid males or male character, that rare percent that normally gets added for the forecast bonus is actually shared between all players. So we're going to double check, make sure everything is working as intended. But potentially a lot of rare bonus today. So for people wondering what to run during the event itself, I mean, today would be the day of rare monsters because it is rare monster, but also rare item percentage. But honestly, it's not really a bad choice to just go for uh, rare items in general the entire event. The reason being that 20% or more, especially with the daily bonuses, is pretty much on par with the 125% or so anyway from the weekly bonuses. So it's just kind of like a whole week, two week, three weeks of rare week. Now it can stack with the bonus, so potentially when it actually does transition over from rare enemy to rare item, you're going to be seeing a lot of people running some crazy runs, usually something like your classic red rings, but who knows? Maybe people will be doing other kinds of hunts. So what I'm going to do while we wait for people, I'm going to go ahead and boot into the game. Really important question, does it stack with cookies? Uh, probably not. Cookie bonuses are not really... They don't really stack with anything. They used to. I don't think they do now. The only thing that might stack could be the forecast bonus. That I'm not sure about. I don't think the inherit 20% works, but I mean, I guess we could find out. Are you gonna make me sad? I mean, it's it's true. The cookies the the cookies don't really stack with anything usually. I say usually. Anguish stacks with it though. Well, welcome, Promethean. I mean, we can humor you with a quick test. I don't expect anything, although it would need at least one other person to join to verify. Did I beat Final Fantasy Adventure? I did. It was very convincing. It was first try all the way through. I saved all my crystals up for that final boss, and that final boss stood zero chance. There are a lot of people here. Did I go into the right block? I don't think I did. I was gonna say I saw a bazillion people in block one. I'm like, that's not, I'm like, there's no way I'm in block two. I don't believe it. So it seems like the usual group is up there. I don't usually play block one unless I'm looking for public games. But I see Promethean has followed me. Do you want to test something, Promethean? We'll do uh, I don't know. I'll call it cookie test. Not gonna bother putting a password. So we should be getting a percent bonus. So if we end up with 5% or something. You haven't played it in a few months? I barely have to do it. 
You don't even need to bring the cookies, to be honest with you. It's more just to test it. I really doubt that it stacks. I would not bother. The time you are taking to go find the cookie, I don't even think it stacks. Because if it doesn't stack, there's no point. So we should be at a 5%. No. It doesn't stack. Out of curiosity, though, for forecast. Hunters, Newman, female. Why does that not match what the wiki says? Wiki, please. Did it, like, just update? Yeah, earlier it said droids males. It is not that currently. Let's find out together. So, Hunter, Newman, female. So, I could play my phone new world if I want to. Kaiser says, would play it, got my copy of Remaster Persona 3, so I'll be new lifing it the next week. Well, you have a little bit of time for the Valentine's event. I had to think about what that would be. So I'm going to see what the RBR is. <laughs> because now I don't trust the wiki. <laughs> I'm like, this is how it is sometimes, chat. I know there's a delay, but that delay does get annoying when you're trying to figure out what's going on. Okay, so that, that looks about the same. Well, welcome, Kaiser. Uh... I don't know. I guess we'll see who's around. I'm not sure if people wanted to do any hunts in particular. Welcome in Parameter. But I'm thinking this would be... Did you just drop like a million coal somewhere? Ten coal? Look like 30. Thank you for the good luck, Calvisha. So, I guess what we can end up doing is potentially if the group needs red rings, we could do red rings. Another good hunt would be parasitic gene flow. I burned through most of my cookies. I'm not sure if Promethean saw on stream last time. I actually managed to get through a lot of them in my defense. Like, I got down to two cookies, Promethean. That was over 40 cookies used, so I, I put them to good use during the last event. There were quite a lot of games being run. But uh, I do want to see how powerful this character feels at single player at some point. So maybe when I'm done, I'll just try a single player game. See how things go. But yeah, people are looking for very specific things now is the chance. But I'm thinking if there's not too many people, I could go back to block one, technically. Because it does pay to just do the multiplayer stuff. So now this character has red ring, V101, heavenly power, heavenly arms, centurion ability, virus armor, cannon rouge, Josh Minikov. So, I guess we'll see who's here. I'm gonna slash lobby since no point in doing a two man cookie quest. Potentially, I could just host. Yeah, if there's not enough people here, I could just host in block one. I don't normally do that on stream. But yeah, I'm not seeing a whole bunch of people. I guess I can host it in block one. For those wondering, we are continuing with the uh, Sonic Frontier soundtrack. I'm looking at how many names the lobby I recognize from the forums. Mostly just Hitsuki, honestly. The others, I don't know. I'm gonna call it Green TTF. I'm gonna leave the password on for now. So if people wanna hop in, you got two minutes or so. Otherwise, they wanna do some public games, I think. But if there's any other rares you'd like to hunt, now would be the time. Hunter Newman Female. Well, I guess if you were the Hunu World, this would be uh, the, the time to play the Hunu World. Your time is now. Get that 3%. Got 70 cookies. That's a lot of cookies. Ooh, is that better than my current Cannon Rouge? No, it's even. Although... The other one did get NATO bonus. Uh, uh, it's technically better. I should probably take that. 
I was kind of hoping I'd roll a little better with some of these alt weapons. I'm kind of disappointed, to be honest. Maybe I'll do some of those at some point. It is rare enemy, though, so potentially if we do have a full group, I think I would rather do red TTF. The reason being that uh, red TTF would get a uh, Lavis Cannon chance and also Magical Stone Artista, both of which I'd be looking for just extras. But playing in general is generally good enough. I don't think there's anything else I want to bring here. I mean, I guess I could compare against my other waiting red rings. But funny story though, chat might be wondering why I'm not going specifically for a rare enemy. If people have missed my conversation on this before, I am not a big rare enemy weak believer. I will I will do episode four at some point. It just I looked at the clock and I'm like, the beat is not quite right. So sadly I don't think I'm gonna be doing even beat shenanigans in episode four. Like if I really wanted to, I'd have to do it now, and honestly, I don't feel like doing that right now. Fun fact, of the seven red rings I've acquired, four of them were not during rare week at all. Sometimes you just gotta go for the grind chat. You just get it anyway. Hmm. I'm noticing a distinct lack of grinders in my bank, which is kind of annoying because I know I have them. They're just not on this chair bank. I think I actually need to put away that cannon rouge then. I literally can't grind it. I have three grinders in my share bank, so I put all like 200 something on different characters. Okay, so we'll do a final call for people in the chat that would like to hop in. Welcome, presumably in Parameter. Hmm, I think that should be good. Yeah, this character has basically everything he needs to carry. Oh, I didn't even notice we had a force. Oh, that's nice. I'm gonna go ahead and set pass to nothing. Technically, we still could get frozen shooters during TTF. <laughs> I'm not gonna complain about more chances of those. That's not going to be the focus of the run, for sure. Hmm. Q is greater than Mada. Maybe. Okay. I think I got everything I need to carry. Got my Cannon Rouge, got my Vulcan, got my arm. I think he answered with the HU was an HU is greater than Mada, but not the Mada. I feel like we got trolled. So come join us in Parameter. We're waiting on you. I was gonna say, if he brings out the dark flow, he'll be, he'll be a he'll uh, he'll make me a believer. <laughs> I always love to see fully geared characters. Where is in parameter? Oh, there we go. Oh, I can shift to D-Van this round. Oof. Oof. 
I was gonna say, can you imagine? Hope you didn't forget something, it's fun. I'll be mostly damage carry. I am 180, I need to damage carry. Son of a... I don't have Excalibur. It's not the end of the world. I have a backup weapon. I think I misread one of the items in my inventory as Excalibur for some reason. I'll go pick it up next run though, for sure. As soon as I swapped, I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> that, that was an Excalibur. I think I thought I put it in my inventory when I switched uh, Cannon Rouge, but I just didn't. Unfortunate. Did I get frozen for zero damage? Huh. I thought that was always supposed to do damage. Also, that sad moment I go to Rafoe, but the box gets popped. I tried. Huh. I guess there's a difference. I know if you're too close, you take damage on the landing. I didn't realize you could be frozen without taking damage, though. Interesting. Oh yeah, that's right. I got I got buffed. Never mind. <laughs> I'm not I'm not playing uh, solo Ramar. I'm like, wait a minute, the kills. I'll let you guys got it. I think you got it. I want my XP. At some point, we'll probably do episode two just for the sake of, um... Uh, he's gonna stay behind. I'm just gonna move them. I'll do episode two maybe to get some rappies at some point. Although I haven't decided which quest to do. It could be like Cal's Clock Challenge or it could be uh, VR for rappies. Cal's Clock is very quick though. I can't believe I forgot XCOM, my bad. Whatever, I got the backup. I'm assuming with two other people with XCOM we're good. I have everything else I need for the other fights. Just not this one. Unfortunate. Oh, I got invincibility again. Damn, sick. Yeah, it didn't matter. That, that really didn't matter. I was like, yeah, as long as someone had Excal, we're fine. I mean, I could get by with Cannon Rouge. It's very slightly slower than Excal. That sad moment where I Rafoe but the box got destroyed again. So sad. One day. Yeah, the buffered Rafoe is so good. It saves so much time. But if somebody pops the box because they cancel faster, how much I could do about that? Yeah, I got Spread Needle for the upcoming boss. Did not bring a frozen shooter. Got charge arm though.
<laughs> Don't mind me, just walk getting in a straight line until they all die. Oh, I think this is the first time I've played a four player again without a cast. Quite some time. Usually there's at least one. Oh, by the way, I am definitely greeting for the sorcerer at the end of this. It's PS, by the way. Did I seriously get confused? Can you please? I mean, the red ring is helping a lot. Don't get me wrong, but like, come on, confuse. Once he levels a little more, I'm putting cure confuse on him permanently. The way TTF starts becoming annoying. Um, I guess I'll go for it. Actually, well... Oh, I'm setting up the, uh, what's it called? The Ryuker. Not bothering with that BS. I just decided to go for it. I was like, I could have spread needle, but I'm like, nah. I went for fast strats. I thought about... I think I hesitated by like one step, but I didn't end up getting punished, so... We'll take the, the one step. So I thought about it for a brief moment to spread needle. But I was like, if I Ryuker at the end, it's fun. That was my thought process. What is he doing? Please don't. Why does this always happen to me? Are you, we are so lucky he did not pop that screen. We are so lucky, chat. That was not faster. The fact that I got down to the last hit on the third screen, that was definitely slower. This happens every time, chat. I'm gonna get tilted. I was going to revive you, but you got revived. There we go. My buffer for Foey worked. <laughs> I finally didn't choose the box that got destroyed instantly. Yeah, as, as a forest, it's very easy to do that. It's a very easy room clear. I love buffering the Rifoe. Uh, I haven't decided what I want to use on this enemy. Guess I'll do that. Uh, I'll go this way. I'm going for the sorcerer, by the way. Right, Chat's got that one. So I'm not going to teleport because I want those indie bellers dead, just for clarity. I want them ultra dead. We're playing green ID. We go at least to uh, Sorcerer. Murdering the hell out of these Indie Bellrows. Oh, he thought I'm teleporting. No oh, thanks. Oh, slightly out of range by like a step. I can't believe it. I misjudged it. That's what I get for taking a break from PSO. A second one. <laughs> That's what the rare percentage is for, just for clarity. Ah. Okay.
So I'm gonna go pick up my X Cal leader. Worst thing that happens is I switch characters to go pick one up because I know a character who has it in case I don't have. I have like the lamed Argents in the bank, but those aren't good enough. I could try the V801 strategy with him. I do have a spare V801, but kind of like I like my max stats. Maybe in like two levels, I'll think about it. Rip Hunter. Oh, I hate going cross screen. Rip Hunter again. I would love if I don't have to go that far. Alright, let me just revive. What is he doing? Like, actually confused? <laughs> I'm tempted to not revive him if he dies again. Oh, he backed. I was like, oh. I was like, I was like, how is that possible to die that fast? So, like, there's no way. I was like, there's no way, chat. I was like, so, something's up. <laughs> Did controller disconnect? There's no way. People die to it every once in a while, not like three times in a row. That's that's ridiculous. All right, we're going to do climbing scales here. Good. I got a little greedy with normal special special there. Normally, I want to do normal special hard with an all zeroed heaven striker in terms of hit. Uh, greed. Oh, I got every hit there. That felt satisfying. We're going to heal. Then we're going to switch to Yashminikov. Well, that was big damage. I'm just going to back up in case it's targeting me. And I go back towards the middle. Oh, I missed targeted. Targeted, that was bad. I think I'm the only person doing damage, oh no. Okay. I'll fix this. Oh. <laughs> Stop! Pick another attack falls. Him, please. Alright, good, it's over. <laughs> falls, falls was stuck in a loop, chat. Sadly, there was nothing I could do. I was slightly too far to dodge consistently. So, at some point, inevitably, I'd have to take it. I did dodge at least three of those by baiting towards the middle. Uh, I'm gonna use Yashminikov, and then I'm gonna hover, I think, my Heaven Striker. Hopefully I could get a chance, because if it goes full screen like this, there's nothing I could do. I just have to use the Yashminikov. Speaking of have to use the Yashminikov, uh, I'm gonna use a Foey here. Wow, that is so unlucky. For me. Ooh, big damage. Heal spam time. Uh, I might be able to kill it with Heaven Striker here. I'm gonna go for it, if given the chance. Although I got knocked down, so I can't go for it now, I just realized. Let's chip it a little more. Okay. I, I, I didn't feel like killing while somebody was dead, just in case. Especially when low level. But yeah, there's no way I wasn't berserking it. <laughs> Be real with you, chat. I'm like, I'm gonna delete this falls. Goodbye, falls. Alright, so let me get my Excalibur for next time. I don't think it made a big difference in the run. I honestly, Cannon Rouge was good enough, but it feels better just to have it. Dimate, interesting. <sighs> I never really get Gazonded. That's so sad. <laughs> that, that feeling when you go to Rafoe the boxes, like, is that so sad. Oh, well. I'm just going to take this opportunity to fix my items. 
This is a before. I'm somewhat flexible in what we do. But four man just kind of makes the most sense in general. Where is Excalibur? Uh, so it is in here. Gonna go get some dinner. Be watching the stream though. No problem. Hope you have a good meal, Promethean. I don't think we're gonna go super late, so we'll see what happens. So if there's any hunts you would like to do in Parameter, now would be the perfect time to speak up. I still have like a million scapes. Oh, I love flying a quest and going scaped all positive. It's a good feeling. Like, yes. All you gotta do is just find at least one while you play. Oof. Gotta get rid of... What do I have a lot of text? Gotta get rid of text later. Hmm. Secret gear, attribute walls. I could probably put the secret gear as a way on a different character. I don't think I need most of these on demand. I'll have to see who has my uh, grinders. I'm assuming it's one of my old characters. Ah, well, we'll see who's available. I mean, fortunately, TTF always gets games. That's just kind of one of those safety factors. If we managed to get a four man in our custom chat, as I said before, I think I'd prefer red ID. Because then I could go for some slime. I went ahead and made another game. I think I'm good. So if there's anybody that'd like to hop in, we're not in block two today since it's the Valentine's event. So we have more than enough free slots. Mostly doing red ring at the moment, but there if there are quests you would like to do, today would be the day to request it. <laughs> So we'll give the chat a moment or so due to stream delay. Then I'll be clearing the password. <sighs> Should I bother with Frozen Shooter in this run? I'm kind of at the point where I'm like, hmm. The only thing I might need it on is Centaur. That's about it. Everything else, it just out DPS it and it's fine. Okay. Yeah. I don't see anybody else saying that they're going to join, so I'm going to go ahead and clear the password. Yeah, with at least level 20 buffs, I'm not feeling really concerned. I mean, I can pretty much do it with level 15 buffs, to be honest. I'm, I'm 180, I could do whatever. But at least for other people, if they happen to be between 80 and 150, Level 20 should up carry. Let's go ahead and welcome Pebble. Ah, uh, the Ramar life. Oh, similar outfit. Close. It's got more of the purple. Same haircut though. I like the, the the hair and the outfit matching the ID. I love that with characters. Technically, we could do it with this group. I just prefer four people, not for the clear speed, but for the rare bonus.
Okay, so we'll give another minute or so, then we'll get started. Surprisingly, not a lot of takers during the event. I'm actually kind of surprised. I know it's Rare Enemy, but still, it is an event. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna give them literally another minute, and then I'm just gonna go. I have a I have a limited amount of patience when it comes to waiting in PSO. I don't mind waiting like a minute or two. Five, ten minutes, not my thing. We got other things we could do. We could be doing a quest. So we're gonna let that hit 821 and then I'm going. I'm gonna give them the, the courtesy 30. Oh, right. Oh, right as I threaten to move on. War and it's a force? Worth. Worth. That is a lot of damage boost for everybody in the team. No, the force name of Lilith sounds very familiar to me. I wonder if I have grouped with this person. I was gonna say, oh, shifter was a little slow there, but that's fine. That's called a minor inconvenience. The important thing is we have it now. Ooh, not a level 30 shifter. Ooh. Hmm. I'm gonna check. I'm gonna check later. have it in my share bank. That would be an excellent opportunity to help another player. Since they're using non 30 Don't mind me, just attempting to view data while playing. Oh, I didn't get the username correct. I forgot. Oh, maybe it's case sensitive. Hold on. So, my techie character has it. Freeze on the slime. Interesting. Yeah, I'm gonna say if I did not immediately give or hand out a level 30 shift to D ban, I did not play with the person. I can stay behind. I probably killed the fastest anyway. Oh, 
Oh, photon drop. Damn. Damn, I gotta walk no matter what. Rip. I ha I have to walk. It's unfortunate. I had to. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I had to. Unfortunate. Would have saved time, but I'm like, mmm. Then I just... I'd go about the same distance regardless. Actually, I should have had Canavrush here. I don't know why I swapped in Excal first. Uh, oh, I got knocked down. That's not good. Oh yeah, I, I played that a little too cautiously. I could have been a bit more aggressive. I could have gone for at least two sacrifices before it did anything. Ooh, nice Gafoe. I like that actually. Instant box pop, box popping. Uh, I don't think I could kill with Yashmanikov in multiplayer. Vulcan might kill. Almost. It was very close. That was within like a bullet. That was within a bullet. <laughs> just also, I don't bother shooting the uh, the turrets. I just take it to the face. I don't usually have the right weapon equipped to deal with it. Okay. Where's the rest of our group? I I have to wait for them. They're they're way too far away. Normally, I would just start the room, but I'm like, no, no, no. They, they were like two rooms away. I got to adjust to wherever, whatever they're doing. Right, he's going for the room. That's fine. Deleted that enemy almost instantly. Man, if this guy just would not hit me for a second, that'd be nice. good damage oh it's nice to see a 1440 in there although I hate when I accidentally pull these guys when I don't want to uh I'm just gonna straight up go for it we're gonna play the ballsy play good luck team Party wiped. Uh, TP up. Ooh, that dodge was sick. I dodged point blank. I got hit on the way back though. Yeah, unless there's like a cast there, I really just don't feel like dealing with those robots anymore. As long as I'm the one that does it, <laughs> I'm okay with it. It's kind of one of those things I talked about before, the downside to it. It's like some people know to wait for the TP, some people don't, and you should- oh, please stop shooting it. I beg of you, please stop shooting. Oh, reduces damage. Uh, it's like on the wrong side now, thanks to that. Really sucked. I had a glitched monitor. It skipped the monitor completely. That sucks. 
Uh, that's gonna make it take forever. I need to, you know what? I think at this point, I'm gonna, if I play more public games, I'm literally gonna set up a quick chat that's like, please stop shooting the monitors. <laughs> I think I'm at that point, Chad. I swear it happens so often when I play, it's crazy. It's crazy. I think I'm like eight for 10 at this point of public games where somebody shot the monitor while I'm doing it. There's only one time I've ever seen somebody do it correctly. And that was so sick because it was so in tandem. It literally didn't interrupt at all. And they and they interrupted with uh when I was doing lightning, they were doing uh normal shots. And they were max stats, of course. Uh I'll do something like this, maybe. Oh, I whiff my Vulcan press. That sucked. Why is no one in here? I didn't realize I was flying so low right away. I was like, man, I thought it was a little ahead, not like I can do like seven attacks ahead. Oh well. I don't trust the team we're with. I trust in Parameter. I don't trust the others, so I'm gonna go and take the warp myself. So I have no faith. Faith shaken. Yeah, I don't mind grouping with them again. They just gotta get with the flow. It's just one of those things. You just gotta point it out when it happens. Just like, uh Big damage. Damage. Heavenly arms, nice. Uh oh. Group's still fighting. Strike a ton. I'll leave it up to their discretion. Some people want to find their own level 30s. Personally, for me, I didn't care what techniques. I was like, techniques are literally already RNG garbage. <laughs> I'm like, listen, if you got them, even even when I was first making my character, I'm like, listen. I have gone entire character playthroughs without ever finding Ryuker. I'm like, I'm not going through that again. Those days are over. <laughs> Imagine playing 1 to 80. It never, it never showed up in the shops. It never dropped. That happened to me on PSO already. Not an exaggeration. It never appeared. It's really, really unlucky. I think I could have been more aggressive with the early shops to make it appear, but uh, still got really unlucky. To not even have it as a casual drop is brutal. Yeah, we gotta teach this person how to do the spinners. Yeah, it's definitely people that are not as comfortable with the run. You can just kind of tell just by tech choice. Like, they're looking at weaknesses. So they have the right idea, but it's not the right spell. spam heal no matter what here Ugh, hopefully I dodge this okay that could have been really bad it was a good dodge it's 
So again, the intent is to try to move as much as possible in between, so that way even if they target me, it's not a big deal. Oh, I got clip. That's fine. Move back in. Give myself a safe spot. I'm gonna move back in. I can tell people are not killing their spitters because I'm dodging the ones from other players. It's kind of unfortunate. I mean, I, I have to do damage because if, if I wait for the team, we're not going to kill this boss. Sometimes I just have to recognize it's not my role. Even if I want to help, it just doesn't make sense. I gotta just do as much damage as I can. Oh, I was so worried it was gonna drain me. I'm not gonna lie. I thought for sure that was gonna kill me. Oh, is 931 enough to survive multiplayer falls? I really need to remember these numbers. That's the problem when you switch between single player and multiplayer. I'm like, I know in single player I'd live. Multiplayer, I'm like, hmm, is it 880 or 920? Uh, I'll do safety heal him. That's a lot of damage. Unfortunately, I didn't math that quickly. Ooh. Come on, seriously? Wow, I got short cycled there. That is really unlucky. Oh, this is going to be a long battle. I can already tell. If I got short cycled there, it's over. We're going to have to deal so much damage here. Oh, how did that not hit? Game, please. So close to getting a kill. There we go, big damage. Had to put on the carry pants. <laughs> like just, just do like 4k plus on a combo, it's fine. GG. Red ring says for me, Thean. I doubt it. Oh, nice level 100 for a parameter. Hey, if Lilith doesn't take up on the offer, I'll be like, they're lost. It's free damage. I don't even want anything for it. I was kind of laughing because I posted in the Discord when I got my Red Rings off stream. I was doing like the dumbest things ever during like TTF. It was like one of the most unoptimal TTF runs of like of all time. <laughs> like I think on this character, it was like a 27 minute clear. I literally got up and was taking a phone call <laughs> like mid run. And just I just let it hang there for like 10, 10 minutes. Uh, it's like, of course, those are the runs you get Red Ring on. Not the ones where you try. Do another green TTF. The burden of rangers. <laughs> do you mean do, being the damage carry? I think that went mostly fine. Gotta teach them to not hit the monitors. True. But hey, at least I got red ring now. I'm, I'm max ATP. Feels good. Yeah, without like a really solid... I think that's the problem with my ult characters. If people wonder why I end up playing Ranger or Force, it's because like... In order for me to pick Hunter, I really have to trust the group I'm with. To <laughs> be real. Like, I would trust Kaiser, Promethean, Hellcleave, Imperameter, Dango, Tiggy. Other people... There's no faith. <laughs> faith is gone, Chad. It's, it's over. <laughs> but it's just like that kind of stuff. Of course, a friend of the stream, Chris. 
but it's like, uh... There we go. Welcome, Dango. You are indeed trusted, Dango. Although I guess I don't usually play my Ramar that often, but it is male, to be fair. I guess I could also play... Another character, female character. I don't feel like playing Uni World. She's the wrong idea, though. So we'll wait a little bit and see what happens. Out of curiosity, where are we at in the uh, Frontier soundtrack? Three hours and 14 minutes out of six hours, 36 minutes. We got a lot of frontiers left to go. Yeah, I think a lot of people... I think a lot of people that end up joining as randoms, unfortunately, don't know I stream, so they don't get to hear me complain at them. <laughs> so at least the people in here, I'll trust. Ooh, level 200. Ooh. <laughs> Interesting. I'm still not going to expect top tier gear. Listen, there's one thing I've also learned is just because somebody's level 200 does not mean they're geared appropriately. Yeah, ideally I'd probably play Yuka Seal. She's red ID, gets 2% from the daily forecast. But she can't damage carry across the board. She's close. She's close. If she could hit 180, then then I'll believe in her being a full-time damage carry. She's a good secondary damage carry. She could use Dark Flow. She could freeze trap some annoying enemies. So there's some things I'd like with her, but man oh man, without buffs, profound sadness occurs. All I know is I'm not the one buffing. <laughs> That's all I know. <laughs> oh, there we go, nice dodge. Don't make me buff myself. Right, I'm gonna buff the buff out of pity. Is that another escape doll? Nice. Love to see it. Ooh. Love the freeze trap. Ooh, a dark flow user. Okay. Alright, that's serious. That is a serious character then. Level 200 hue cast with dark flow? Hmm. Big swing at time. I did somewhat enjoy the Dark Flow once I started getting used to it. Honestly, this stream has basically seen the only times I've ever Dark Flowed. I think I did it on three separate sessions. We had it when I did uh, Respective Tomorrow. I did one where I was in TTF with it, and then I think there was a stream I tested it literally for the first time ever. But I did end up enjoying it when I played with it. It made me happy my Hyuka Seal had that 15 accuracy barrier. The ultra rare one that's like a 1 in 2200 on normal or some dumb, dumb stuff. <laughs> that definitely helped with landing it. Not something I'd want my Hue cast to try to land, but it's like just good enough for her. I'm let chat just continue. 
Uh, yeah, see, this is a player using, uh, what's it called? Crush Bullet? No, no, Meteor, Meteor Crush, I think. I didn't think about it. And, like, I'm not gonna shame them for their equipment. They gotta do what they gotta do. Alright, I'll stay behind. How did that not kill? I think a bullet missed. It's like actual blasphemy missing his Ramar. Yeah, fortunately, I don't super care about D band. Oh, of course, I don't have invincibility. It sucks. I'll do at least one sacrifice special there. Oh, that was so fast. That was so fast. I did not mean to hit, heal the Hugh cast. I definitely thought I was not near him. Wait, I healed him from there? Oh, I feel less bad. Wow, that, I'm actually really surprised that I healed him then. Whoops. He's got a wild charge Vulcan, I guess. So we'll see if he goes for confused strats or if he just goes for room clear. Honestly, at this point, I'll, I'll go with whatever the level 200 wants. I'm not that picky with the strats. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> See, they knew. They knew They knew I was going to clean it up, and they moved on. I respect that. I respect that. Save that time. Oh. I can't hit it. It's frozen, weirdly. That sucks. That was unfortunate, actually. Couldn't do anything with that. Alright, so he's going for the, the tried and true strat. It's fair. Need them to clump up a little. Yeah, so I think the other player freezing them over there is making them miss my charge shots. It's unfortunate. That's that's where the experience comes in. Like those are the stuff we point out for the people that are curious on stream how to improve your game. Like, because it's a multiplayer game. Oh, I have to spread needle here. I'm not gonna make it through in time. I would have gone through, but there's no way. Oh, they didn't kill the other brands. That was so scary. That was way scarier than that should have been, for sure. It was way scarier. Holy. It's like, wait a minute, brands actually got to move? That's not good. Oh, I was so scared I healed him. I'm gonna practice the self heal only. I forget what the input is. I, I so rarely play public games, I honestly don't remember. It's like I have to open the menu at some point, so that way my Resta only targets me. But like, I've done it on stream maybe once, and I've done it maybe three times total since I played the game. Because most of the time I'd prefer to use healing items when I'm getting greedy. Uh, and Parameter, do you have the V801, though? Because th I think that's what the assumption you V801. Just say no V801 if you don't have it. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, I, I think they're making... See, see, I would never make that assumption. Ugly. Hmm, yes, I don't have V801 on this character. I could maybe... But I, I think I would be at not max ATP. If I get like two levels, I'll like perma to one this character. Oh, I did get captured. It's awkward. Do 
check the dark blue there actually. Uh, so they, they dealt with that, so I didn't have to care. Oh, they're going that way. One. At least I could say I went for it. I mean, you might as well just roll two Psycho 1 chances, chat. I'm just saying. <laughs> Chat talking about doing cycle wand attempts, so that's what you need. Just play green ID. Every TTF is cycle wand. Your ult rare is red ring. <laughs> v101. Those, those are the god ult rares. <laughs> like, okay. I'll take that all day. So at least you could say we went for cycle one more than once today. Although, to be honest, if we do do serious, like, cycle wand attempts, I still feel really burned out from uh, the Christmas event. I don't think I recorded any of it because it's a very boring run, but essentially it's like less than one minute resets of a uh, Christmas fiasco one over and over and over and over and over. And I did that for eight hours straight. And I'm like, you know what? I saw like 22 Del Lilies or whatever, or Mill Lilies, excuse me. I'm like, good enough. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I, I'm lilied out for a little bit. Just a little bit. And that run is very fast. I like that a lot more than the B caves, but it, obviously you can only do it during certain times. Oh, actually, that name well. I got rewarded for double special there. Yeah, see, there we go. See, I already knew the Hue cast was doing damage, so I just committed. That's an example where you have to kind of do on the fly party calculations. Like, do you feel in five seconds, 9,000 damage could be dealt? And a lot of that just comes from experience with grouping up with a lot of people. Like, I didn't communicate it. I didn't say anything. I just, I recognized when they, when the, what was it? The Galatine was out. I'm like, oh no, no, that's, that's the real damage. It's coming. Yeah, I was going to say, he missed something. I, I'm not sure what he... Oh. That's super awkward. Yeah, and I'm going to do big burst damage there. So the reason he said kill, for those not aware, boss had 1,900, he had 2,000. So there is a 0% chance he should have died there. Unless he's doing some silly shenanigans with Berserk. <laughs> he's... You're a souling in the corner or something. Anyway. I think that went mostly well. Look at that. Sub 12. Actually, curiosity. Now that I have red ring, how? No, I'm four ATP off. Yeah, I'm like literally a level from unequipping Centurion. I'm so close. 
<laughs> was like, I'm like, I was like, I remember I was really close to just having full time V801 for TTF runs. So yeah, about a level. I don't know if I'll care about three ATP off of cap or one ATP off a of cap to be honest. Put these away. Look at the big hearts. Do some quick menuing there to get rid of escape dolls, and let's go back to it. So I think what we'll do, we'll go at least until I level, and then we'll figure out how else to help other people. So I could do more friendly runs for other people. Unless you just want TTF, then I'm not going to complain. <laughs> but I figure out I would offer the olive branch. Because this character is so close to being able to do it. So close. Ooh, somebody with the Promethean icon. Pass now that Imperimeter is here. Welcome, Hell Cleave. Hope you're doing well. We're doing ye old casual TTF. Block one today, since we don't have a lot of people in Twitch chat at the moment. They're doing other things. Oh, that name. Oh, did they crash? Rip. Hopefully things are going well for you, hopefully you. I was actually surprised I didn't see Diz on earlier. Oh well, such is fate. You'll jump in whenever? Sure thing. We definitely have open slots. <laughs> we, the fact that I'm in block one means we got a lot of freedom. So if you want to jump in with whatever it is for Hellcleave's advantage. Hunter's Newman female for the maximum bonus <laughs> for those Valentine daily forecast boosts. I was thinking if we had a strong enough team, I would just play my uh, red female hunter. That way I can provide at least 2% boost. And plus, I, as I said before, I wanted to do red ID at some point, and she also needs levels. And I can practice dark flow with her. I think I've used it for like a total of less than two hours. <laughs> Yo, the spring of force, if anything, that's fair. Well, if Hellcleave had a phone new world, he felt like leveling. Wheeze that rare chance. Yeah, that would potentially work. Then I don't need to level this character. I could do it whenever. Because I'd rather... Four unis, go, go. Yeah, pretty much. The only time I level it at the moment? Oh, poor Hellcleave. Yeah, people are welcome to bring in whoever they want. They don't have to bring in top tier. I'm like, listen, I understand. You do what you need to do to level your character. But yeah, I was thinking Red ID would be an interesting TTF mix because we don't do a lot of that. And then I need to actually verify which uh, drops I, or which enemies I'm skipping with Red ID because I don't remember offhand. I know I'm absolutely not skipping slime. 
Uh, Hildevere in the beginning has something that I want. I don't remember if there's anything in the mines I wanted with Red ID. Those are the kinds of things where I'm like, I almost never run it. So I'd have to think about it. I'm on the wrong side of Dragon. Damn. Oh well, we'll make do. Yeah, my Hue New World is the wrong level to be doing this. I don't mind doing a uh, Hue New World uh, RT. Actually, that's a good point. If chat wants to do RT, my Hue New World is a uh, blue ID. So I'm going to offer that as a an alternative. That's still good levels. <laughs> and she can she can damage carry. She has Dark Flow, potentially. I got to I got to not sleep on RT. Even though Beach puts me to sleep, I should not sleep on it. I would not have expected Screamer, Rock, and Sonic, but here we are. See, this is more like Sonic that I would think of. I'm gonna let them do that. I'm gonna go kill, get the other kills. So yeah, I think that'll work out because I don't want to do TTF for literally like another two hours. So I think we'll do a couple of red ID runs on a TTF and then we'll do an RT. I think if I run, I should still outspeed and get there before taking a warp. It's a lot of enemies. Oh, I was gonna pop him. That sucks. Unfortunate. Too many Robardos couldn't hit through them. Just got it with the invulnerability, nice. I also got invulnerability, so I'm gonna take my pop shots here. I do actually need that grinder. I'm just gonna heal spam myself. Really prefer not to back for items. Like the red robot dying in the ceiling. That's a classic. Arson Keys, Normal Slime, Sinnoh Blue. Ha oh, Sinnoh Blue is Kasami? Good to know. Yeah, I knew they had the Psycho Wand. I, I remember looking that up the other day. SN off of Bringers? Ah, oh, no, no, no. Yeah, that's not worth the wait. Well, well, it'll be like the uh, the the monkey bar, <laughs> where I just I just happen to get them even though I'm not farming them. The one of fun ofs. Ooh, I actually dropped my Vulcan combo again. I want them to group out. Man, I still died almost instantly with uh, Red Ring. Thank you, Red Ring. I would have 100% died. Any other armor set up? I'm going to choose to let the team decide which one we go for this. Could have maybe run through. Oh, I got hit 
get out of it. That sucked. I tried. I'm not going to shoot at all. They said they're doing screens. I'm not touching it. I want to hear the, oh, why do you not do this? I'm not touching it. I do not want to be blamed. Probably skip Kasami. I I'm not looking for Kasami Bracer. Just looking over what Hellcleave noted. Oh, that was scary. I thought they were going to shoot again. They had a small delay. That's fine. They got it in the end. They scared me, though. <laughs> I was like, I went very risky. I don't like doing that normally. Uh, I think it's Heaven Striker time. Oh, that enemy is in the way. I'm gonna heal before. Oh, I didn't realize it was Scotty there. That sucks. Oh well. Yeah, I just want my quick uh, second wand attempt. Nope. Did get the item drop though? Proof, proof you can get the item. So yeah, I'll switch it up. This character is not in a rush to level. They're at a good position. If I can level the hunters, for sure. Them potentially having a red ring is huge. Hugh Oral or Hugh uh, Casil both would benefit from the extra ATA. So yeah, I think we'll do at least, let's say two to three red runs and maybe we'll do two uh, blue Hugh Oral runs to end the night of RT. I think that's fair. Because I, I know, uh, you know, if we're not waiting a long time for runs, then, you know, TTF should go pretty quick. So we'll say... We'll say maybe go to at least 10 o'clock with the red ring attempts, and then we'll just do probably two TTF, or not TTFs, uh, two RTs. I know some people are not excited to see TTFs and RTs, but it's like, well, those are kind of where the meta items are. Just have to play it sometimes. <sighs> I really don't want to be there. I was uh, mispositioned. I shouldn't have been in the middle. That's kind of the tricky thing, is if you end up fighting spinners you don't normally fight, you lose track internally of how many spinners there are. Oh, did you see that micro step dodge? That was so sick. That was so sick. Aw, I better get credit for that. That was so good. That was that was believing in the pattern. Straight up believing. <laughs> I was like, I waited till the last second to hit up. It was dedication chat. I could have kept shooting, but I'm like, you know what? We'll go for it. There is a... 
there's a couple patterns where if taking a small step is good enough to dodge. There's one where if you're like constantly moving, it's not good for you. And I was just hoping I didn't get that pattern. That's all I was hoping for. Oh yeah, that was big damage. And then I can fireball a couple times here. There we go. That was a nice kill. Good dark flow from that. Oh yeah, <laughs> speaking of sad things, like I, I have used dark flow so little times, I didn't realize the light projectiles or dark flow shots did not go past the barrier until I played with it on stream a while ago. Then I felt so sad. I was like, oh, Hunter almost, almost had a free win. <laughs> what a shame. GG. I'm so sad. I got a 40 hit shadow gladius. I think that could be teched up into hell. Maybe? I forget. Ever, you know what? In my defense, in Affinia, it always used to tech up, so I didn't think about it before, and now I'm like, hmm, does it? <laughs> I feel I find myself second guessing. It might not. I'm gonna hold on to it for now. I'll deal with it later. That is 274,000 from leveling. Yeah, that's like zero time at all. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to switch characters. Yeah, because the, the sad thing with uh, the weapon specials is just how inconsistent it is after the actual legitimate fix to it. So it's just been kind of annoying to tech those upwards. No, never mind. It has to be dark. My bad. I was confusing shadow and dark. Never mind. I don't think it can double tech up anymore. I mean, I'll leave it in there just in case. I'm going to put the Excalibur away. Is there anything else I need? Why'd I buy monomates? This click. Okay. So I'll switch over to the Hugh Seal. Make sure I put my uh, Excal back. Or I'm going to be sad later. so few grinders in the share bank now it's so sad yeah it's a shame the other person didn't ask for the level 30s i did have a couple on me oh well put away some of my money i need to keep some money for charge arm but fortunately now that my atp is capped you know i'm not burning like hundreds of thousands to clear a run just like pretty consistent recoverable amounts of meseta just by playing ttf so i'm still going meseta positive I think Imperameter was bringing in, uh, 20s. Yeah, we'll do, uh, Red TTF. I'm gonna make sure to bring in Last Swan. I love that gun too much. It's an addiction. So we'll say at least three runs of red TTF. So that's what I wanted to do earlier anyway. And Parameter is playing Hugh New World though. Elk Weave. I'll be doing blue ID for RT. For sure. Alright, so I'll do red TTF. You swap to War Marl, that's fine. Yeah, I just figured this just offers more of a bonus. S Parts version 2.0 was the thing I was trying to think of earlier. So I have Charge Gunnier. 
<laughs> I have Jaya for the worm. I don't need S Red Blade while I'm playing multiplayer. Put this away. I got Mech Gun for safe clear. Where's my last swan at? There we go. Um. Hmm. Do I need anything else other than Dark Flow? I don't think so. Oh, no, no, no. I need Berserk. I forgot this character doesn't have a Berserk. So I'm going to take my 60 hit Berserks with Dark Flow. So this will be nasty. I'll bring an Excalibur just to test some things. And here comes the damage. <laughs> Oh, it's a 35% dark flow on dark. So much damage. Um, I don't think I need this many weapons, but it's fine. We're just going to commit to the vice early, so we got to drain our HP. Are there any other people in the chat that would like to join in? We're going to go for, like, my fourth ever dark full of TTF, I think. So this will be a fun experience. Scotty MDT says he me, no problems. Welcome, Scotty. I had a feeling you were probably listening to the stream, but welcome. I'll uh, clear the password. Actually, if you want to join Scotty MDT, uh, our password is just King. We just do that to make sure we get the people that are in Twitch chat in first. So if you do K I N G, there you go. Perfect. And we can say hello to Scotty. So definitely excuse the roughness of this hunter. <laughs> As I said before, I, I gotta I gotta get more experience with Hunter. But at least I got freeze traps, so there's that. So I know my goal is to... Ooh, actually. I'm gonna go delayed start. I'm gonna go pick something from my bank that I think I need. I need either Girasol or uh, Lava's Cannon, I think. I didn't think about that until just now. I should have one of them on this character. My bad for the delay. <laughs> Where is it? Does she really not have one? EP up, thank you, thank you. Okay, I do have a Lava's Cannon. <laughs> of course. D of all the things I don't have, I don't have a Gear Assault. Whatever. I got time to get the bonus. Whatever. Okay, so we just gotta drain our HP. Nice Heavenly Battle from Hulk Leave. <laughs> it's casually getting a, a easy rare for people. Okay, so I just gotta drain my HP. So I'll stick to Berserks on Dragon, but I do need Lava's Cannon on a couple of different points in case I have to emergency heal without uh, targets. And today we will learn to do a little better. So rough start on the first one, but that's fine. Ah, uh, that should be good enough. Yeah, there we go. Now I'm gonna do the special dance. I really don't want to regen HP. I think I could have been one step closer, but I'll take them. Okay, now I can regen a little bit of HP. We got Valkyrie, interesting. I forget if that's used in any of the new crafts. I'll pick it up for now. Don't mind me just gonna casual fire trap kill something. I'm going to the next room. 
I feel like dark flowing this. Just slap all of them with dark flow, don't mind me. So, no rare slimes yet. I could let the force spawn a few before I go on a killing spree. Okay, let's pop a couple. Guard we found, interesting. Yeah, one thing I need to check here. What is her accuracy versus the worm? Ooh, it's not great. But that's why I have Jaya. <laughs> like, there we go. That That's why we have Jaya. We're good. <laughs> like, listen. I'm like, I wasn't liking that, like, 80% 80, 80 chance of landing it. It's like, nah. Let's not deal with that. I saw that club drop earlier. Not interested. Hmm. So normally what I would do here, if I'm trying to get extra photon drops, I'll go for Confuse. But it is a bit riskier. If I'm playing low HP. I literally just do that to fish for PDs, and I have gotten PDs that way before. Unfortunately, I did not get it this time. Hmm. Do I go for the Confused Trap setup as the Yuka Seal, or just let it rock? On the Barans? These are the questions I ponder as I walk towards here. I just realized I don't have a normal pistol for shooting these, so I have to shoot it- Oh. Someone popped my trap super early. That's unfortunate. Rip. You know what? I'm gonna go for it. Oh, as a reminder, team. We don't we don't have to fight this in O's. I to mention. <clears throat> I just figured while you were fighting those, I might as well just confuse trap it. It's fine, we'll take those. I definitely do not want to be the one dealing with the monitor. Uh I mean, I could. I could have. I could have technically brought out the twin blaze. Need to use that a bit more. Trying to lower my HP for the fight. Should have lowered it a little more, but at least I got most of it drained. So I could do like one vice into dark blow, maybe. Yeah, there we go. There's the laser light show. I will gladly take escape doll for later. Heavenly HP, nice. Actually getting a decent amount of the ult rares of the run. I'll, I'll give it that. Kinda nice to see. Uh, I'm scared of these. <laughs> I know they hit for big damage. Go away from me. Okay, let's make our way to the sorcerer. Oh, I got healed. No, trolled. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> so close. I went to dark blue. 
Now, now I'm a true dark flow user. I did a chat. Is that another escape doll? Hmm. Okay, using my charge Vulcan equivalency. I'm absolutely killing you. Goodbye. I'm going for those cycle one chances. I don't care how what the odds are. Gotta go for them. I brought last swan specifically for this phase. And honestly, it's okay against the next phase, but ideally, you know, if I got a charge weapon with decent hit, uh, that would make more sense. I could berserk myself if I'm feeling, uh... I guess the word is spicy. <laughs> Into uh, the ring around the rosy phase. Do I believe I will make it through without getting murdered? I doubt I would get hit very often through from the spinners here, at least while using last one. Like, I might get a hit. Yeah, last one too good. Love like the cluster chasing after me. Get away from me. See, so, yeah, I'm sticking to the left side since that's what I'm more comfortable with as a player. Plus, when you play single player, you kind of go like this way anyway. Oops. My healing item was not where I thought it was. I deserve that death. I gotta remember, the casts are laid out a little differently because I want to do the hot key for the quick heal. It was not the button I was thinking it was. What button is it on? Oh, okay. Now I see. Today we learned. Yeah, normally I don't assign the healing on like the one to four. I sometimes assign Trimate depending on the character. But the other ones, like, nah. Okay. Yeah, I think if I do this again, I'll dump a couple items, because I'm seeing some items I'm just straight up not using. Like Rainbow Baton I'm not really using, unless I'm going for a switch kill. didn't focus on me that was uh, okay that was belief if if it had been targeting me i would have been hit because i didn't move but fortunately we were spread out enough belief won yet again all right so if i can i'd like to vice the boss not too far <laughs> now you're just trolling Ah, whatever. Team's got it. <laughs> oh, wait, go in front of me when I when you're invincible. This is mean. Don't make me carry elemental weapons around falls. Don't make me do it. So let's clean up her inventory a little bit. I like her items. I don't need this many for the run. And then I really got to resort my items. Because I went to uh, go from like Dimate to Trimate. But you can even see in my order here, it's Trimate then Soul Atomizer. So seeing that threw off my menuing completely too. So let me go fix that. So I don't get like menu stun locked. Put away the Valkyrie. Honestly, I didn't really need the Excalibur. If I have Jaya, I don't really need Excalibur. Put away the gun year. I think everything else is fine. The mech guns are just there for safety versus falls. I still got two skip dolls, so that's fine. See, we'll do at least two more. And now that we have a solid group, uh, that definitely cuts down the time. <laughs> like, we had 11 minute runs, but we're, we're waiting like five minutes for people. Not ideal.
So yeah, so I'm learning where I need to lava blade a little more. Since I was looking for Girasol and didn't have it. And I'll just call it Red TTF. Password as always is King. Good luck, Siskani. Thank you for helping out. Hopefully you have some good luck with uh, Red Ring in the future. So if there's anybody else that would like to hop in, because presumably Scotty is done for now, we have a free slot. Otherwise, we'll be opening up Password in another minute or so. I have two Tri-Fluids on me when I was playing with uh, Forces earlier. So yeah, I think this is probably good enough. Jaya for Warm Boss, Rainbow Baton if I'm panicking versus Switch. But honestly, most of the time, probably just leave Vice Equip. And sorts of vices at the top. Yeah, Vice Jaya, Lavis Cannon. Those are the ones I want at the top. Dark Flow could be at the bottom for fast menuing. Okay. I don't see anybody else jumping in, so I'm gonna go ahead and clear the password. Yeah, Smart Link helps a lot. Heavenly Arms is good, so max accuracy. So she's as good as she can get until she gets the red ring. She's technically got one waiting for her. Ooh, I love the name. Just WAR, all capitals. A lot of HP. I'm assuming a male character. Ramar? Or Humar? I knew it wasn't a cast, <laughs> based off the level. I was, I was going through my head. I'm like, who has that much HP in mail? That's close. Do you spread needle? Yes. Yes, I, I can't do anything against full up. Oh, I technically could use Gunyir here. Or I could just Jaya. If I super don't care about my cash, Jaya is also fine here. Oh, I got healed. Damn. <laughs> Rip. I, I did actually lower my HP in time in my defense. I tried. Rip. So close. I got down to sub 100, which means that I should always be able to do it in that scenario. Uh, so I gotta build up to Dark Flow again. Get the laser light show going. A little help cleave dance so I don't regen. Then I panic run away from dragon so I don't die. Oh, I actually popped the box. Nice. Oh, no, no. It was good fun. It was good fun. I got excited there for a moment. I thought I did something. <laughs> it's like, nope, never mind. Better player. <laughs> That's fair. Oh, oh well, I guess I can just disrespect Dark Flow in the face. I guess there's always that option. I'm gonna switch to the last swan after I put a freeze trap down. It's a shame last one doesn't multi hit the trap. So I probably have to bring a different gun just to quick shoot it. Because the Vulcan's very awkward if I miss, and I just don't have faith in it at all that I'm going to land it, given my lack of hunter experience. However, if other people have Lieutenant Mantle, that saves me from trying, because I don't feel like trying. Okay, time to see if there's any red, red slimes. So far, no.
Yeah, so we'll let a couple spawn, then we'll get some kills, because it is at least, if nothing else, free XP. I think it's Jaya time. I mean, I could technically Rainbow Baton the uh, other creature. Let's see, Chad. How unlucky am I versus this boss? Will I get invincibility? I got healed. Uh, uh corner? Nope. I saw the boss target me. Did you see that, chat? That was rude. The lone tentacle, it's flailing final attack. Tsk, tsk. So we're gonna go for... It's Confuse Trap, but what I'm mostly looking to do is just make sure I have Charge Mech Gun here. Put out another Confuse Trap just because. I might get a lucky Photon Drop from this, depending on how close they were to the other Confuse Trap. Um, not close enough. I think I waited a little too long. Yeah, once we kill the Red Sino, we could just go forward. So, uh, at least I'm not interested in Kasambi Bracer. Time to get out of here. I guess I could have had a slightly different weapon for that, but that's fine. Nice. That was already in position. Good, good, good. So my goal is to just love his cannon. Oh, I should have got hit there on purpose. That actually would have been the big brain play. Big brain play. Just get punched on the way in. So I got injured a little bit, but I got to get injured more. So I'm just going to spam lava cannon. So this time I have the right weapon equipped. So hopefully I can get into like the 120 range. kill ourselves to that. I learned the hard way. Gyrasil will kill you, and I believe that will too. So now I have low enough HP because I've been spamming uh, at least something to drain my HP without interrupting the other fight. So take a step forward and do damage. Okay, that's pretty good. I think I did that strategy mostly right. I'm gonna call it perfect, but... Yeah, these are the things I have to just kind of learn from testing and playing a bit more. Like, what drains my HP the fastest? Like, obviously Vice definitely tanks my HP like nobody's business. But, like, when I can't target, which is better? You ate too much? What did you miss? Well, I'm playing uh, Hugh Casil. You have not missed any red rings. We had some assistance from Scotty earlier. I'm going to... <laughs> just go ahead and do this. That damage is so high. So close. Whoa. <laughs> oh, bob and weave, bob and weave, chat. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't die from that. I'll be real with you. Uh, let me just get rid of these monomates. I don't need them. So 
Hopefully you had a good meal, Promethean. We'll be doing some more red TTF, so we'll have be backed up to a four-man group from the Twitch chat. Because I'm assuming War is a random person, because they joined after I cleared the password. So we're going for off chance Psycho Wand, off chance uh, Lavis Cannon from Slime. We're skipping Sinnoh since we don't really care about Kasami Bracer with where we are with our characters. We're at a point where we pretty much only care about Red Ring. Rip Hellcleave. Gotta go more to the side. Gotta go more to the side. Oop, none of those are targetable. That was a mistake. That one is, though. So, like, I could vice during this phase. I mean, I'm probably better using charge, to be honest. It's because the next phase is just so inconsistent. Although, honestly, that was a fast kill. We definitely have the DPS. <laughs> the boss died pretty fast. Just the downside is if I go mech gun here, like, sometimes I'm not close enough to do the shots like that. Unfortunate. Go back to last one for a little bit. Hmm. Do I go backwards on the off chance that it's following me? I think I do. <sighs> Did you see me dodge it? <laughs> Get out of here. I'm on to your shenanigans, Dark Falls. I'm like, hold on. Hold on. Nice try, though, Dark Falls. You tried. I think that's the most on-stream laser dodges. I've done a lot off-stream. Solo. So I know it's targeting me. I think I've gotten more practice in with what it's weak against. Right, so depending on what it does here, I would like to swap into Charge Mech Gun. Nope, too far. Wow, that was fast. <laughs> I like hovering the weapon. I'm like, oh, if I could get away with Berserk, I'll use Berserk. It's kind of funny walking up and dying Dark Falls in the face. <laughs> and things of that nature, of course. Or x -Cal. GG to the team. Ooh, look at that. 1057. That was the fastest one so far. Yeah, we want to make sure we pop these boxes because potentially some of those could be uh, weapons of interest. Sadly, I think I got one where I got cheated by the special, which is really unfortunate. Yeah, this character gets a little bit of time in the sun. I've been really enjoying her in some off-stream games a while back, closer to Christmas, with the kunai. Kunai is still my new favorite item on this character of all time. I went from being kind of miserable in Episode 4 to like, oh... Between Twin Blaze and Kunai, I'm like, I'm finally free. I get to have fun. Permission granted. So we'll see who's around. We'll make another one in block one. There's Google Bonker. I think I've seen them stream a couple times. I've been grinding away at the realm arm. Yeah, and because this character is a female hunter, not doing too bad here. So we'll do at least one more red TTTF, and then we'll do maybe a couple RTs. So I'm doing my best to boost the bonus <laughs> to play in the spirit of Valentine's event. I'm thinking not tonight, but maybe maybe in the future. I will finally do the actual Valentine's quest of Valentine's event. I still have yet to ever do it. I think allegedly that's how you're supposed to get Rambling May before it released in episode four formally. I think. I don't think it comes with hit percentage, or else it would be godlike. Oh, 
But we'll do that for the content, as it were. So we'll wait a minute for anybody that would like to hop in. Otherwise, we'll open it back up, no password, and block one. So yeah, I think the right play so far has always been Vice. I could Rainbow Baton, the first group. That's where Gunnier is useful. Just depends on how close I get to the edge. But Jaya is also fun. Although Jaya being 25 hit and dark is a little sad. Do I really not have a better Jaya? I thought I had like a 40 percenter, or is that on Hue Cast? Could be on Hue Cast. Ideally, I want that to be all A Beast. So I don't even have like a super top tier Jaya. Yeah, I just have like a mediocre one here. I think my Hue Cast might have my 45 or 40 percent hit. Unfortunate. Oh, I did have a Girasol in here. Okay. Time to experiment then. Oh, I had a spare last one in here as well. Huh. Red handgun. E yeah. I was practicing with Drill Launcher. I was not having a lot of success with it. I gotta, s I gotta watch somebody do the Drill Launcher strat on the Volt Op. Like, I think I understand how to do it. Obviously, it doesn't really work in multiplayer. So, it's just something I'd have to practice with her a bit more. But I think she was sharing the uh, the red handgun. I'm more interested in the gear assault at the moment to see how much HP I can lose. Alright, let's clear password. Yeah, because that just allows for trap shoot. I should just go pick it up while we're waiting. The sadly, last one does not trap shoot. That's like the only downside to the gun. Yeah, the stupid triple bullets just don't hit the trap correctly. E even Vulcans can do it. They're just very awkward. I just prefer not to trap shoot with Vulcans. Eventually, I should practice it, but that's something I'd rather do off stream than on stream. But at least a 35% hit uh, red handgun is kind of funny. I'll have to get one with, like, legitimate, uh, machine percentage, though, in the future. Anyway, back to our vice. Yeah, her stats are not well done. She has to redo her materials, but I'm not gonna do that until, like, 175 or so. So she just has to get XP, then I'll do the reset. And obviously, if she red rings, a lot of this will be solved. And she's Black Hound Grace for a lot of defense, but S part, I think, does not add pretty much any defense. Yeah. So she ends up being ultra squishy. We'll do the crying. So we'll wait a little bit for a fourth person, then we'll get started. Yeah, it was kind of unfortunate. We were playing with some lower level players. I would have loved to have given them items, but they didn't really seem to respond when I messaged in the group chat. Because I think, you know, these are the opportunities for people that want to learn on stream. Like, this is how you, this is how you learn. You get to hear somebody tell you, like, what to update or whatever. And or get free items. <laughs> Either way, the gameplay improves. I'm going to double check that I cleared password. Otherwise, we'll get started in a moment. And we'll switch over to uh, RTs. And I'll bring in the Hue New World, and I'll make sure that I bring my Dark Flow Vice combo. So we will wait until, let's say, one more minute, and then we'll move on. Since we have other things we could be doing today. So I feel like I gave a good courtesy two minutes for TTF. So if they're not interested, they're not interested. Okay, it's now officially 9.50. I'm going to start heading towards the counter.
Hmm. Was that was that rare rate correct? 115. Why does that feel wrong? One second. Oh, three is ten percent. My bad. I thought it was fifteen percent. That now makes more sense. There we go. I so rarely kill that Bartle. <laughs> Might as well showcase it while I double check stuff. Bonked. Oh. I was so close to not getting hit by that. That was so sad. Dead to the head. Ooh. Pick up the monomates, are you happy game? Hmm. Okay, just making sure I still had skip dolls. I say goodbye to that slime. I just wanted that XP. There's no reason for me to not kill them for PDs. <laughs> I was gonna say that was so bold. Did did you feel the belief chat? I started my combo with special. That was that was straight up belief. I did that on a hunter chat. What do you even think about that? Bold. I did not mean to heal there, but that's fine if I did. I'm going to be using Jaya anyway. A little last second XP there. Uh, you know what? I'm going to heal. I'm just going to commit to Jaya. I could go for a rainbow baton on the first hit just because, I guess. There's no downside. This is free damage. Oh, now I get invincibility? Whatever game. So I might as well do this because it's free damage. This is literally better than just not doing anything. It's pretty fast clear. So I don't know if I hold down and to the right, I can angle myself in the middle of the raft, or if I hold like down and back, I'll end up in the, near the item. So that way I'm just like instantly there. <laughs> things things I figured out while bored playing TTF. I'm just like, oh, I could just make sure I'm always in the right position. I should just do that. There's no reason for me not to. I mostly just forget it, that that's a thing that I could do, to be honest. Oh, there we go. They finally killed themselves with Confuse. That time I did it correctly. Hmm. Which the last one here, I think. So that is my soul atomizer button. That's good. I may might have been a little overkill there. I probably could have gotten away with monomates. Oh. 
I keep forgetting Imperabeater can see my traps. That's so sad. Oops, my bad. I can account for that if, if I think that's a thing. That really sucked. Also, I definitely meant to take charge on, or the charge mech gun, and I definitely pulled out the vice. So that was a big miss menu on my side. Actually, do you mind hitting me a couple times? I'd appreciate it. One more punch. Thank you. Takes me some time later. <laughs> there we go, chat. The big brain strats. No. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> Uh, let's learn. Let's lose some HP. Okay, we're good. <laughs> just need, I just need to not be at like a, th a thousand one hundred. I could just barely get there in time with Lavis. I gotta compare against Girasol at some point, but not right now. Actually, you know what? We got time. Ooh, Girasol absolutely cripples my HP. Yeah, I guess that's the downside of losing HP. Get bodied by the next phase. Back to Gira Soling. Oh. I didn't realize it was behind me. That did so much damage. I really hope that wasn't my last skip doll. Oh, it really was. I didn't get revived either time. That really sucks, actually. That really sucks. Damn. Zero revives. So I'm at escape dolls. I'm in big trouble. I don't have a lot of HP to survive falls. And I could very easily just die to vault off for no reason. Oh. Speaking of which. Yeah, that's kind of the unfortunate thing. If I get body there, there's not much I could do sucks when you get revived because then you gotta reheal. I gotta figure out like the best way to lose health rapidly. So it's like I know what to do when things go well but when things don't go well that's where I have to learn to adjust. So like what would I have done differently? Like Lavis Cannon was slower. Gyrasol definitely seemed faster. I think it just due to the weapon. Oh another skip doll thank you. Now I'm up to two skip dolls. Where the heck is my... Oh, there's my... Okay, next time also. Oh, I could use Red Hand Gun just to cheese, like, stupid damage on falls while I'm waiting, because I got nothing better to do. It's actually kind of hilarious. I mean, unfortunately, it's not a fire gun. That would have been ideal. Okay. Yeah, so here's what I learned. Gearsol I definitely think was faster, especially with her animations. And I think it just, it looked like it drained more. But Lava's Cannon was more secure. Like, if I just want to lose a little bit of health, definitely felt like I had way more control over that comparatively. Love that charge mech gun, it's so good. No Psycho Wand rip. Technically not the last Psycho Wand attempt of the night because we're going to be playing Blue ID next. So I'm going to put on last one. Yeah, I think some of it's just going to come down to... You know, once I get Red Ring, then I don't get bodied by, like, the Ice Blast. Because the Ice Blast did, like, infinity damage to me. And I died, because I think my Ice Resist was... It was okay. No, it's not okay. Never mind. I thought that... I thought that was the one with the 30%. 
So I think once I get a little more there, I should be good. And obviously, once I get closer to 1500 health, I'm more leniency with things like Gear of Soul. So I could survive, like, stupid hits on Forest, for example. That'll be nice. Or having so much roll defense that potentially a uh, gel end enemy doesn't hurt me at all. Those are the things that are going to make it fun to do Dark Flow a bit more and also Berserk. Ooh, I got stuck behind, but that's fine. Fast damage. Hopefully I could turn around fast enough here. So I'm going to hold up and to the right and I'm going to hit the camera button. I'm going to hope I line up with falls. No. Unfortunate. I was a bit further up than I thought. Um, I'm actually just going to keep walking forward. I should be able to dodge this. Yeah. We're going to go hard left here. Or whatever, you know what I mean. <laughs> Left relative to uh, the radar. Yeah, that's fine. We get knocked down. Our HP's low. So here we kind of have like two choices. So if they get close, if I have something like an Excalibur and I'm lucky I can use it, but more often than not, last one is just going to give me the range to go full arena. So I'm going to step forward a little bit. I would ideally like for the boss to swipe at me and then I can vice it out of range. Out of range of that though. Oh, we got short cycled, seriously. Wow, that really sucks. I'm gonna walk slowly. I'm gonna have to burn a dime here to not die. Uh, this is gonna be interesting. I'm dodging. Shadow elected not to kill me. I think I had escaped all. I would have been fine. <laughs> there we go. I did 27 damage. Take that, Falls. Died a red handgun. <laughs> Goodbye, Red Ring. So yeah, let's do a couple RTs to mix things up a bit. I'll switch into Hugh New World. 50,000 XP, not bad. Chat's going the other way, nice. Forty hit gun year with no special. What a waste. Shake your head, Chad. Every time you see stuff like that, just shake your head. I think that went okay with just three people. I'm gonna put away some items. Okay, put away the vice, cannon, the dark flow. The way these. I don't think I have enough red handguns for them to be purely on my cast, so I'll put the back in here. Are oh, you done for the night? Thank you for playing in Parameter. I'm also not going to go too much later, to be honest. I don't want a late night stream after today. So if there's other people that are interested in hopping in, please let me know. Yeah, I got a V502 if I really need it. Everything else is good. It cost me a bit of money because I used Jaya a bit more than I probably should have, but that's fine. Hunter has to make some sacrifices when they play the game.
Yeah, I think it's my Hugh cast that has the Jaya with high hit. Which is fine, like, he needs it. Give me one second, and we'll get started. Just checking something. I mean, they're basically the same level, but eventually I need to get them a little more leveled. So I think my goal of the year is to get at least one of my hunters to 180, whether it's the Hugh Cast, Hugh Casile, or Hugh Duerl. That'll be my end of the year goal. That just involves playing the game a bit more, which will happen quite a bit during the anniversary event. Oh, you had my other Girasol. I was like trying to do, in the, I'm trying to do the math on my head. Like who is the other Girasol? That checks out. So I'll try to do a... Say blue RT. In block one. Hopefully we get a couple people joining. Oh, hold on. <laughs> I did not menu that correctly. Take two. So I'm going to go ahead and get the vices from here. The Lavis Cannon and probably the Dark Flow. Where is the Dark Flow? Oh, there it is. It's weird that it's between Galwind and Slicer Fanatic. I just, in my head, I don't put those items close to each other, but there we are. So she's at max ATA. ATP needs a little work. She's already got a Kasami Bracer of her own. I mean, 42 across the major resists are kind of nice. So she does not super care about fall damage, for example, or vault op damage. She already has an Adept on. So if she just gains raw levels, I don't need the Heavenly Power. And then eventually, Adept, Smart Link, V801 something. She's got the Blue Adoshi Violet Nibidao to free up a slot because she's so slot hungry in this game. So it is what it is there. And the Adept giving an extra 6 stall resist is kind of nice. Let me sort so that the current weapon is at the top of my list at all times. Let's see how we feel about this. Okay, I'm gonna go clear the password. But honestly, if not too many people join, I don't mind doing an early out of PSO. Today has been a rough day. So I think if we do play again, it'll be on Sunday, so hopefully people will end up being more free. Oops, instantly in. Love to see it. See, so yeah, at least I can bring the level 20 shift to D bands and stuff, so that frees health leave up a little bit. We don't really need super buffs when we're playing versus any of these bosses. I have last swan for okay boss damage. Oh, it looks like we have a force anyway. And that works. Oops, baited. The no cure paralysis kind of sucks though.
I just realized, what am I going to be using on the worm boss? I guess I could use Gunnir. I mean, I should, probably should use Jaya. But, uh, Gunnir is fine. Not super optimal, but better than nothing. Here we go. This wave does make me smile every time. There we go. There's the held out. Goodbye, held out. Ooh, she does big damage with vice. Man, last one is so good. Lowen's sword with hit percentage. Interesting. Nope. No photon drops. Welcome, TMG Sean. Oh, cool. I made it to a stream. Watch like one bot on YouTube and getting them recommended nonstop. Oh, no. Well, hopefully you like some of the VODs. If it's Terranigma, I'd like to apologize to you. <laughs> if it's PSO, then it's probably fun. Oof, Terranigma was uh, exhausting. What a game. <sighs> Out of range. It's been all PSO. Oh, that's... That's the algorithm working for you, for sure. So I haven't uploaded PSO in quite some time. I don't think I've uploaded since... One day in January, I think? Maybe two? So we just came back, because it's now the Valentine's event. I did promise the chat a bonus stream of PSO. So we are back with some PSO. But if you would like to hop in, always let me know. We are happy to have people in. We have uh, Hellcleave, a staple of the stream. <laughs> what? I'm sorry, what is the song? Sonic, please. <laughs> Th this is reminding me of Knights in like the worst way. Sonic, please. All right, well, I will go skip this song. It's the double whammy of child and lyrics. Where is this? I'm super not feeling the song. We're moving forward. There we go. Maybe on a power leveling day? <sighs> I gotta drain my HP. I might go for Dark Flow here. I'm not sure. Nah, I missed. Not accurate enough. Ooh, only a 25 Zalore. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. Alright, so what do I need against the boss? Just Gunnir, I think. Yeah, we do some power leveling days. I'm actually surprised Diz didn't show up today, because I know he was asking about uh, leveling ults. I'm not going to focus on it as much during the events, unless it's literally just XP up on the event, then it's whatever. Just because this is kind of like the week you would play for rares. But definitely we've done a few power leveling sessions. I think literally the last one we did on stream was a power level session. So we'll help players of all gear, does not matter. I think I did good damage there. I, I did like uh, 12,000. I got my gun years to land. Yeah, 
There we go. Speaking of making them land. That's decent damage for a basic weapon. Yeah, because occasionally I'll just get bored. Like, that's also the other meta, is if you play too many of the same quests, you're just like, screw it, we'll do some other quests. Do roll a shell, nice. Hold on, I think the key is if I look at the strip on the floor, I think I go left of the strip on the floor. Listen, chat, this is this is the boring, the boring boat meta. I think it's slightly left of the strip. Like that's my visual cue. So if I if I don't align with the thing right now, I'll look where it is relative to the strip. But I'm gonna hold forward. Yeah. There's my visual cue. Chat, that's how you know you're bored. <laughs> Like, when you're playing RT, you're like, listen, <laughs> I have like 20 seconds to wait. I might as well figure out a way to optimize leaving the stupid raft. Oh, RT, you're something else. But yeah, I know how Pleve has been making mags for newer players. So I'm not sure if you're a force or you're a ranger or whatever. But definitely... Mags plus materials make a big difference with damage if you're playing ATP. If you're playing force, it kind of depends. There, there's going to be a certain threshold where it's really good and then you f it falls off a cliff. <laughs> where ATP only scales higher and higher into the heavens. Oh, you know what I forgot to bring? I forgot to bring a uh, kunai. That's fine though. I could still clear some basic switches, so we're good. I think the other thing I was trying to experiment with lately is what time to release the videos for people that watch on YouTube. So I'll probably ask the next couple of times when we start a game while people are still somewhat awake what time they prefer to get the notifications. Because I think 12 a.m. was like, it's the default, but I don't feel like people really watched at that time. You get all these little funny analytic things once people start watching your videos. It's like people are active from... People are most active at 12 o'clock and 6 o'clock that are your standard viewers. So I shifted it a little bit to see what happens. Uh, I'm going to let chat destroy the switch that's behind me. by brands. Uh, so now I gotta injure myself. I swear if this boss does not give me invincibility I'm gonna be so sad. I'm gonna do one lava's cannon just to make sure I don't have enough Good, I got invincibility. I was gonna, I was gonna get so salty. <laughs> like, you, I swear, if I did all that, all that damage to myself, I thought I'd get invincibility. See, this is why you need certain mags for invincibility. Not having invincibility like this means I can't do what I'm doing now. Or I just straight up walk into the enemy and then just do this. You can see, I could do a lot of damage, but I gotta get to the point where I could do something. We're going to safety die mate there because I don't trust myself to dodge that. Made a few mags, just need the levels. Yeah, I think the thing is, is just like if you party up with just a couple people, you'll you'll get to 80 in no time. And we don't mind carrying people to 80 through our ultimate stuff. Nice, I just leveled. Speaking of levels. So, yeah, we all understand. We just got to get people there. So what we try to do usually before a big event is we do try to get like a lot of XP. So we'll try to play the XP weeks during the event to make sure that players can enjoy on ultimate. Those kinds of things. Yeah, if Diz was here, no joke, we would have been doing XP grinding because Diz was asking to uh, level his force. El Cleave was looking to level one of his ults. And I don't mind power leveling people. 
So depending on how long you stick around, I don't mind just doing like one or two very hard mode things just because. Because I'll get burned out of RT. <laughs> RT knows what it did and why we're not on speaking terms most of the time. So yeah, it's more just getting a feel, more just getting a feel for what uh, people are interested in. Although I have a super hard cutoff at 11.30. I do not want to stream past 11.30 tonight. No worries. Yeah, I think our next big session will be Sunday. I think that'll be rare items, so we're going to be hitting some of these kinds of quests. So I would expect a bit more variety. Unfortunately, we kind of came in at not even beat, which kind of sucks. Because otherwise I would have been doing episode 4 over what we were doing today. And I cannot promise like a 7 a.m. start, but or like 7 p.m. start. But I think potentially for Sunday, I might start earlier than 7 o'clock. I do need a food break. I just haven't decided how many hours between what we're doing early Sunday afternoon versus post lunch. So I'm not going to hard commit to a time, but I'll be playing for a while, I think, on Sunday. Because I don't think uh, the following Wednesday will be a long session either. So I'd rather grab people while they're like somewhat awake and also available. Nice, Ajaya. Oh, uh, zero hit though. Yeah, the other thing is I do need to give myself downtime. Unfortunately, the event started right when I wasn't sure whether it was going to happen or not. But uh, we'll be covering ultimate when we're done with Valentine event. I have most of what I need prepared. I just need to talk with Hellcleave at some point when it's like not an event. Because <laughs> I'm like, it's we could talk about it during the event itself, but I'm like, uh, we, we need to grind it out. If you want your short term list of things to look for, look for the end game items. You need your heaven strikers, your red rings, potentially your dark flows. Slowly got to get yourself a boss weapon and then get yourself a nice crowd control as needed. I'm gonna guess since I don't see Hellcleave, Hellcleave went into the Sinnoh room. That's why Hellcleave got bodied. Yeah, that enemy was straight up dodging. That was insanity. I'll rebuff people. Hmm, shame that Force doesn't have level 30 shift though. I gotta lower my HP for the boss. Swear if they heal me. <laughs> it's like, I was like, Shadow is like, I was like, swear. It's <laughs> okay. So, for those that don't know the strategy for the boss, as a reminder, don't move. If I see players moving, I'm gonna be like, frowny face. So, we're gonna teach by example. I'm not gonna move. I will try really hard to hit them with Dark Flow as they go above me. So let's see what happens. Okay. Did some damage. I feel like the boss is going to target me, so I'm just being very careful. Let's 
speaker. Oh, the camera rotation. That was rude. That was so rude. <sighs> that was so rude. It got me twice. Unfortunate. So what happened is I started moving, but I wasn't like holding move the whole time. I was just kind of like starting to slow down to see what the boss was doing. But the camera whipped upwards because the boss did the aerial dive bomb. So sad. That caused me to die, actually. I think had I been holding the button, I would have been fine. I would like to point out, chat, I still have yet to see Cal Griffin's wing drop. <laughs> I, would just, I would just like to throw it out there. I have literally gotten seven red rings and three Olga flow, um, Parasite Gene flows before I've seen one of those drop for me. Thankfully, we had somebody pity drop it. I might have been Dango, I think, maybe. I could be misquoting who gave it to me. But uh, I still have yet to see that item drop for me. It's so sad. It's not even like it's not even rare. <laughs> it's like it's like actually not even that rare. It's kind of crazy. Given how much RT I've done, I should have seen it at least once by now, statistically. We're getting into the possibly over 90 clears without seeing one territory. It's pretty bad. Revive them from here. Oh, the other guy teleported up there already. That's annoying. I don't think I can angle that from here. I hit the robot. Yeah, it's it's pretty sad. I just I don't know what it is about it. I just can't get it. Oh, you know what? I should have brought hell regardless here, because this enemy is kind of annoying without it. Although funny enough, I could just leave. Okay, since I don't have hell, I'm not messing around with it, to be honest with you. Like, it would be pretty funny if we do we do RT twice and we see we see another uh parasitic gene flow. It would be funny. I feel like we're getting close to do one. Someone in the party specifically, not me specifically. Especially with boosted rare rate, I feel like we're within four of seeing it. Statistically speaking. Oh, nice hell. Yeah, the downside is without a uh, red ring. I just don't like my hell percent chance hits. I'll kill these boxes, even though this doesn't open the door. It's just to make it less annoying for the team. Pretty close to Mag Blast if we really need it. I took a couple of hits on purpose, but <laughs> some not on purpose. Oh, pff, this nonsense. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, Kofoe? I, well, kind of worked. I mean, he, he stopped in the middle. Uh, that, that was our Psycho Wand attempt, by the way, Chad. I did not actually think it was going to grant me invincibility. Nice, though. So, yeah, still have not seen it off stream, on stream. The rare is forbidden. Although the Pazuzu streak is over. I think it got up to an impressive, I think it was 22 Pazuzu's in a row, where I failed the one in three <laughs> that many times in a row. It did break finally. It broke on stream. So that's good. It's nice to actually have some semblance of a chance of getting a rare item. Also, another big reason why I stopped caring about rare enemy week in general. I just get tired of like not even seeing the enemy that gives me the chance of getting it. 
it's like that psychological factor. Like, even if it's like a low percent drop of like an enemy, at least I could say I killed a hundred of these. Whereas like I fight the mill lilies or whatever, and it's like I saw zero today. So literally never got a chance to even roll it. Doesn't feel good. Uh, I don't think I stay to help with the uh, fidget spinners. I'm going to just turn my head real quick. Just a reminder, if you don't look at them, they can hurt you. <laughs> Unless somebody else is looking, then it's, then it's too late. I don't ever normally go this way. I guess I will this time. Just to get the boxes cleanly. Or all of them will come towards me. That's cool. So they're going to deal with the Sinnohs. I'm going to go deal with the boxes. No fear, chat. No fear. Just just go in. Why bother timing it? Just believe. Oh, your evasion is so high. Out of my face. Oh, I got stuck on the corner. That was unfortunate. Uh what weapon do I want to use the most here? I guess Vice, if I can? I guess Vice. I don't want a Dark Flow yet. Okay, we're going to hold forward. We're going to go to where Help Leave is. When the boss starts going like below the stage, that's where I have Last Swan to kind of clean things up. If I'm desperate, I could try to Dark Flow the boss. I'd prefer not to, though. Vice is still probably going to be my strongest option for both faces, if I can land it, especially with 60 hit. I'm going to panic heal. Oh, the boss is actually cooperating. So close. Oh my gosh, actually. Given that I'm seeing them freeze, Hellcleave, can you make sure to type to them to not attack until the boss looks around? I, I really, I do not want to party wipe here. <laughs> just, just if you could quickly just be like, praise be, please do not hit this thing. We're going to die so fast. Oh boy. Uh, okay, so here, here's where we cross our fingers. Please do not attack this boss. Please do not attack the boss early. 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 They attack the boss early. Uh, this is going to be interesting. We didn't get punished, though, which was interesting. Okay, you know what? We'll take that. We'll take that. Maybe, maybe they shot like literally right as it started the animation to look. Normally, it just it just counters you and just destroys you. There must have been just like the bare minimum weight. <laughs> Either that or it's broken. You get to decide. But I'm glad we didn't see it. The counter is like the the giant death beams. Nah, it's fine. You never know, Hellcleave. You never know. Hope you're doing well, Doozy. 
We're gonna do one more of these and that'll be it for the night. So yeah, we're just playing with other players, which boosts the rare bonus. That's about it. That's the extent of the Valentine's event. There's technically a quest we could do. We'll probably do that next time to uh, gift chocolates to people. But GG. I'm going to wait for the quest reward. I want my money too badly. I'm greedy. Yeah, I think, uh, well, now that Doozy's here, I guess I could go off topic briefly. I do think Mayhem's in a mostly stable place. I released a hotfix that I think addressed most of the issues. So we should be good going forward. It looked fine. I might have to fine tune for balance in like another patch. But in terms of working as expected, I think it should be there. Let's do one more quest and that'll be it for tonight. again where I didn't go to episode 2 I wonder if I'm just hitting down too quickly I think I'm just hitting down too quickly in the menu I think I actually am just too fast for the game <laughs> be real with you <laughs> like I think I'm hitting it before the menu appears and that's why that happens too fast chat oops there we go So let's clear the password. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, we're in the final hour of the Sonic Frontiers soundtrack. We skipped one song. Put away the flow in case it ends up being useful later. Given that I used to chunk other rares that were useless, but now apparently they're just inventing new systems, so probably should keep those. Any updates to Axe Armor? Uh, yeah, just hot fixes. Welcome, Sir Magic Penguin. Hope you're doing well. So, like, the challenges are slightly retuned compared to when Chris Grimm played. And there were a couple bugs with, I think, three of the challenges, and those have been addressed. So Magic Penguin says, I'm good, but important, how's you? Uh, I feel, I feel burned out from work, to be honest. It was a long day today. I never like an office work. Yeah, and a feeling chat would like the, the challenges. It's like sort of crowd control inspired, but I'm thinking more like Hades, where you purposely nerf yourself, and if you manage to succeed, you get the bonus. You finally need to try Mayhem. It's in a pretty good place if you want to try certain Mayhem. So yeah, Penguin, uh, I set up a uh, whole mod to allow Twitch chat integration for Castlevania. Uh, I like it a lot more than the CC, to be honest. I mean, obviously, I'm going to have the bias of creating it. But I feel like the CC has like some really big bugs in it that the last time I watched it played were kind of like run ruining unless you really know about them, which is really unfortunate. So like a lot of my stuff has additional safety checks. You have to lead me through the setup. I think there's a uh, walkthrough still on my Discord. The video, like, the install has not really changed at all. But also, if you need to, you can reach out to, like, uh, Chris, Chris Grimm and Calvisham. They play a lot. They usually, they test the early, the early version of the patches. You have to join my Discord. Well, if you do exclamation mark Discord, you can get an invite link. So we'll wait for a fourth person. 
It should still be live. I think I set it to basically never expire. Yeah, we have updates there, and if people are looking to race it, I know, for example, um, Mateus was looking to try it with the next couple of weeks. I don't know if he'll do Axe Armor races specifically, but he'll probably do some Mayhem stuff. You have to update my link every 30 days. Yeah, I set it to never expire. It's one of the it's one of the options, I think, when you generate it. So that way I just didn't I got annoyed <laughs> touching it on my uh Twitch. May maybe every once in a while I might clean it up, but it's very rare. Unless I think something weird is happening, like there's a bot surge, then I'll kill the invite. This is so sad, we can't get a fourth person. So close, we just need one person and we could do the quest. But yeah, I saw Penguin was playing uh, Super Mario Brothers earlier. I think all my mods are not in today, actually. So we're gonna do... One at a time here. Oh, Penguin went to Twilight Princess at the end. I saw Super Mario Brothers 3. I caught most of them. During my lunch break, anyway. I guess I'll ask, want to start with just three? Oh, you swapped it to Twilight for tomorrow, I was gonna say. I'll put the option there. Yeah. Because, I mean, at this rate, if if no one shows up in two minutes, I'm not I'm not going to play the quest. It's that simple. <laughs> I'm just like, I got other things I could do. We could, we could talk and have a good time on the stream. But yeah. I'm very surprised, though. I would have thought RT and Block 1 would have been, like, uh, almost an instant appeal. Yeah. Oh, well. Uh, I, I, think, I think that's it, then. Oh, well. Yeah, see you all later. Alright. Oh, well. I would have gone one more quest. So let, let's talk a little bit then, since unfortunately, looks like some people are not available today. Let us put away our items so don't forget to do so. Uh, Gearsoul. Actually, I could keep the Gearsoul in this character. <laughs> the all zeroed one. Okay. Put away the vice. I think I had the Berserk Mech Gun for the Dark Flow, which is not bad, but obviously the vice is just better. So yeah, let's chat a little bit, chat. I think I am done with PSO then. 